making as authentic as possible jerk chicken uh, barbecue as seen um, by us. Yeah. <laughs> Moose birthday on Saturday. He likes jerk chicken, we all like jerk chicken. So uh, Walter's making the jerk chicken fucking production machine. Oh, it's actually my birthday. It's a couple of days, 40. Big four eyes. And uh, we thought we'd just uh, have a, a jerk off. It's, uh, you know, we're heading over to Berlin. Berlin. Touring, doing uh, a bit of sampling of uh, the Yam style in Berlin. And uh, one of the best things there is the, uh, the jerk chicken that they make. Obviously, a derivative of Jamaican cuisine. And uh, we've got chicken over here, we've found all the spices and did some research, and uh, we're jerking on my birthday. <laughs> So now we're going to grind our, grind our pimento berries and go with a quarter of a piece of And what eventually we get is all spice. Or we can use our multi grinder. Extraordinarily hot. Quite, quite hard to eat this. No, yes, I do. going to cut with these spark infuriating tools you need safety shades and some earmuffs otherwise you'll be deaf before you know it. and blind let's see some fucking action
So, um, this is our finished product. I've put a handle up here, which, um, and I've put a handle here. This handle's for opening, and that handle stops the lid from going right back. These handles are for moving it round. Let's go. Instagram here on the side of Dr. Dr. Clark's flavor unit. This is the flavor ratio depicted in a pie graph. Chicken to flavor. Chicken flavor. One chicken to another. <laughs> All right, away. Wow.